In this video, I'm going to show you how to get a high resolution, transparent PNG of any Mac app icon. So something I run into all the time when I'm creating thumbnails for this YouTube channel is the need to get a Mac app icon that I can use on the thumbnail. But oddly enough, this isn't the only very specific and narrow use case that I've found throughout the years when you actually need a high res Mac app icon. And years and years ago when I was needing to track them down, I'd use Google, but you know, sometimes the Mac app icon was old or out of date or just wasn't high res enough. And so when I was creating documents where I'd use these icons or working with other online apps or Mac apps even that could allow me to upload an icon that represented a specific Mac app that I used, it was always hit or miss whether or not I could get a hold of the icon that was up to date and high enough resolution. But fortunately, there is a super easy, super quick trick that you can use on any Mac app and any Mac app icon. So let's go ahead and take a quick look. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do is within your applications folder, just track down whichever Mac app it is that you want to try to find the icon for. So traditionally in the past, what I've done is I've like made this super big and then, you know, you screenshot it and then you start trying to cut it out in Photoshop. No, 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 there's a much better way. And so all you have to do is do Command I on your keyboard and it's gonna pop this little window up here. All you're gonna do, is you're gonna click on this icon and you're gonna do Command C. So just like you would copies, so you're just copying to clipboard, Command C. Then you're gonna open up Preview then you just want to do command N for a new file. And as you can see, it has automatically imported that icon file. You just wanna make sure that you have the top one selected, which is going to be the highest resolution of that icon. Then all you're gonna do is you're gonna to go to file and you're gonna to go to export. Once you've got export, just pick wherever you wanna save it. So this is the Final Cut Pro icon. Make sure that it has PNG selected and alpha is checked. Click save and there you go. Press the space bar and as you can see, you now have that gigantic full resolution icon with the transparent background. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Really quick tip for you today. It's just something that I use all the time and it's simple little time savers like this I like to share on this channel. If you haven't already, be sure to check out my free productivity app called Raiderist. I will leave a link in the description if you would like to check that out. Also be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.